In this video, I will be showing you how to create responsive layout in your Flutter application. There are many different screen sizes available in the market. Therefore, your Flutter application should be able to dynamically respond to each of these screen sizes so that user maintain good quality of experience on your product, regardless of which screen sizes. Before we dive into the code, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. So in order to create responsive layout in your Flutter application, firstly, you have to know the screen size, specifically the width and height of the device. Thanks to media query, you can get the information about what size the device is on. You just have to use media query dot of context dot size, and you can get the device information such as height and width. To access media query, you are required with build context, which is why I added this after the build method because build method provides the build context. Not only that, media query provides sufficient information about the device, such as the orientation of the device. For tutorial purposes, I will just add a print statement to this device information. Now let's try it out in the simulator. So as you can see, it printed out the simulator device width, height, and also orientation mode, which the simulator is currently in portrait mode. Once you got this device information, you can now easily build responsive layouts in Flutter. For example, you can check if the device width is equal to 600, then return specific size widgets, else return other size widgets. So this is how you create responsive layout in Flutter using media query. If you have any question, feel free to comment below. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel. See you in the next tutorial.